Hi guys, welcome back. This is Erin at Perks of Planning and today I have a video of the new releases for our shop. We have two Christmas kits that are going up that are totally different from one another and then a bunch of smaller just singular sheets of new releases so I hope you guys like this type of video I like to see the new releases in other people's shops so hopefully this is helpful in some way but I wanted to show um, our new releases since I just started this channel so first I'll start with our first Christmas kit we're still printing the other one so it'll be um, probably at the end of this video. So this one is called Christmas Owls and it's kind of a funkier, more decorative kit. You definitely have to like color for this kit. This is the one I lean more towards, but the other one is a traditional Christmas kit. So let me quickly show the full boxes because I think that's really like the essence of a kit is the full boxes and so Christmas owls I paired with like a geometric Christmas print so you have your owls and your geometric so you have these um, ornaments the singular owl on like a lavender background and some other geometric just a uh, red, green, a little bit of aqua, pink design, some geometric Christmas trees with a with a little owl in a hat in the corner. You've also got some kind of like knitted looking um, reindeer, another geometric print and an owl holding a present, some snowflakes, and then some geometric reindeer. So this is definitely a more colorful, more vibrant <laughs> Christmas kit. Like I said, I'm more on the quirky side, so this is the one that I'm probably gonna end up using. So in the mini kit, it comes with the full boxes. These are the little checklist, heart checklists um, for to-dos. The headers are, one of my, I love these headers with the um, ornament print in the background. That's what the print is. And we started reformatting our headers so you have your enough headers for a week like to do little things and important and then we also did another whole set of different um, like to go to work and they're all in different colors so if you don't want to use like a to go that's red you can use one that's green so that's why we did that so these three are in the mini kit and then the other Last page in the mini kit is the little things page and you have your some reindeer washi, some snowflake washi that matches the other one. The other one's red and pink down here. This one's blue and green. You have seven um, food checklists, seven TVs, a couple other little things, two sidebar stickers, and two bill dues and some canceled and rescheduled that have the little... Um, geometric in the background and then I just included these little owl guys just because I like to put little deco at the top of the page and then another little owl right here so that is everything in the mini kit and then for the deluxe kit you take out the ombre heart checklist these still come in the deluxe kit this is another page for the from the deluxe kit it's got your weekend banners flags, some icons, some of these, I don't know, circular tabs, quarter boxes, more reindeer washi, and more snowflake washi, along with a bunch of other owl deco. These I love so much. These are the ombre heart checklists. Well, I guess just heart checklists, but they have that ornament print dropped in the background with green and red hearts, and I just, I love pattern and color, so these are definitely me. And then the last page in the kit is the bottom washi, which is that red and green snowflake pattern. We got our little reindeer owl here, and then eight half boxes with different various patterns that are transparent in the middle so they're easier to write on. So that is everything in the deluxe kit and the mini kit. And again, that's Christmas owls which I am a fan of because of how <laughs> colorful it is. So that is everything in the first kit. I'll show the other Christmas kit at the end. A couple um, releases we have. These are also Christmas related. The first one goes along with the owl kit. These are just extra owls or if you don't want the kit, 
then you can just pick up these little owl clip arts. I included all the different owls that were in the kit, including a couple that are resting on trees. And they've got, you've got this one with little candy cane ears, reindeer ears, different hats, um, a present, and there's a couple, well, there's a bunch of different types of owls. So that is the clip art. It's going to be separate from the kit. So, since the kit does come with different owls, but I thought this was kind of cute. And then the other clip art, we have a traditional Christmas kit, which I will show, but this is the extra clip art. It's just going to be sold separately since it's like bigger clip art. And it's got a couple phrases, joy, happy new year, merry Christmas, merry and bright. Like you don't have to have them straight across the page. You could, you know, line them up you know, horizontally or move the letters around in joy a little bit because they are cut separately. And then you have just a bunch of different like floral wreaths. You've got a Merry Christmas, Merry and Bright, Happy New Year with a bunch of like presents, stockings, holly, and just some greenery. There's a more close up of it. You've got some holly berries. Um, some pine cones, just a little bit of decor. I thought these would be cute. The middle is cut out of this one so you could write on it. This one says Merry Christmas and this one says Merry Christmas Joy. And so I just thought that was a cute little addition to the traditional Christmas kit. Some of our individual releases that we've been working on. Um, I had this idea to do weather stickers and I really like how these came out. They're the size of like our countdown stickers, like the Halloween countdowns and the Thanksgiving countdowns. We are going to do Christmas ones, probably owls and traditional. We just haven't done them yet, but these are the same exact size. You've got your sunny, partly cloudy, cloudy, rain. Um, snow, some storm stickers, and then two extra rows of like all the different ones. So these just have a gray outline so hopefully they match a bunch of spreads because they're pretty neutral. Next up I showed these in my last video in my plan with me. These are the meal plan stickers. These are on glossy. That's why there's some glare on it. I just wanted to keep these really simple. There's like a little whisk and a little brown wooden spoon and they just say meal plan and cursive. So I thought these were cute and I've, I've you've already used like three on my other page. So they're definitely helpful for me. Next up, something I've been using a ton of are just these glitter half boxes with the rounded edges. They have all different kinds of glitter, some chunkier, some finer. I want to do different sets of these glitter boxes, but for now I just stuck with a rainbow set and I really like the colors in these. We have a ton of colors of glitter and so I want to make glitter everything, but these are one of the first glitter things that we have and I really have been using these a lot. And then last up, speaking of glitter, I have these little nap time stickers. They take our little eye masks and then we wrote nap time underneath them in cursive and all the masks are in glitter. So I really like these. Just a little bit of a fun way to mark a nap time. So as soon as we get the traditional kit done, I will come back and show you that one. Hey guys, I am back with the second part of the new releases. We finally finished this traditional holiday Christmas kit and we also will have a winter themed kit coming out. It's not finished yet but it's in the works. It's called the Warm Fuzzies kit and it won't be like any Christmas or anything like that, just a winter themed kit. So here is the main gist of the traditional Christmas kit. I just thought the kind of like white cream background was nice and simple. You've got some birds and hats with some snowflakes and ornaments, some bells, some poinsettias, these little Christmas cabins with trees and tiny snowmen, these little peppermint ornaments, gingerbread men, um, ornaments on some boughs, I guess, <laughs> and some more... Uh, birds, some holly, and some ornaments and stars. So those are the full boxes for the kit. And so let me go through the mini kit first. So these four pages are included in the mini kit. You have the half 
you have the full boxes, you have the ombre checklist or heart checklist, and they do have glitter in them. Two different golds, one red and one dark green. I like the addition of the glitter in this. I thought it was too much for the owl kit, but I liked it for this kit. Next are the headers, and they are all softly glitterized. They're not like too much glitter in your face, but they are red, gold, and green headers. And then the last set for the mini kit is the Little Things sheet. You've got some glitter canceled and rescheduled stickers, two different sidebars, two bill dues, some holly washi, a couple of presents, some little um, Christmas candies, Christmas presents, an ornament, some just plain gold washi, and then your two different kinds of little things. So that is everything in the mini kit. And then let's go over the large kit. Again, these three come with it. The headers, the little things, and the full boxes. And then the rest of the kit comes with these ombre heart, I know they're not called ombre heart checklists because there's not technically ombre in them, but these are the heart checklists. They also have green and red hearts and that like poinsettia print dropped into the background as transparent. This is the little kind of functional sheet with the weekend banners, flags, some are glitter, some are just plain, um, your icons, some little uh, tabs, quarter boxes with different prints, and then two types of glitter washi. There's a green and a red glitter, some little holly birds, and some other Christmas decorative icons. And then here is the bottom washi sheet. You've got like a big cardinal, a little Christmas candy, some of the little birds, four half boxes in different prints and they are transparent and then the bottom washi is the bells. So that is everything in the traditional Christmas kit and everything for our new releases this week. It's a lot of new releases and I'm working on them. They should be up um, Monday through Tuesday of this week. I'm already editing the photos. So there is the traditional Christmas kit, the more funky owl Christmas kit with the owl boxes and then a bunch of Christmas clip arts and various new releases. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know and I'll keep doing them and thanks for watching. Bye.